Hello and welcome my friends, we're playing as the United Federation of Planets. Uh, in between episodes, I uh, went through all of my planets and made sure they are now going to be selling lefum, uh, lefium, latinum, sorry, for energy. I'm aware that there are buildings that are better at it, but this won't let me... Oh, actually, I don't have to build a building, generate even more jobs and... Well, basically, my economy is tanking because we have such high amount of jobs. If we go through all of these, it's a lot. We got 27 or 40 population in here. And, yeah, 19 or 31. We need to fix it. We definitely need to deal with this because it's just tanking the economy like crazy. That's how it is. Nothing else. We are tanking our own environment. I kind of wish that the, the, uh, the slaves that some of our, you know, integrated empires were selling, that we actually could get them back. It's, it's uh, annoying to see that they're actually, um, you know, selling one of my population that they got from, like, a migration freely. But, well, we can't do anything. So once we unpause, we can probably see this go up. We are... Also going to get 10 more Bream Nitrate, because why not? And the rest is going to be... So 41 um, should potentially change. Let's also do this one. The Stonic Command is also now going to be a vassal. The Stonic Command is a vassal. Can you imagine that? That means that um, the galaxy is just going to be a better place every single time. I'm quite annoyed that we are not going to war with the Terraman Union. I was actually very much looking forward to that because it is something that we can... Well, we, we had something to do, you know? That, that's, that, that's what it is, right? Something to do. Also, that's not right. Uh, third fleet, right? Oh, yeah, it's a, it's a mix-max of about everything... Excelsior class. Actually, this is the run. Let's change that. Yeah, it, for some reason, it just doesn't like it when I do that. Excelsior class. Let's uh, click the third fleet on again. I don't think we can actually get more ships out of this. It is at Starbase, so it should be able to upgrade really soon. The second fleet is still moving. Let's get towards... This one, yeah, it's just a few more jumps. These will probably fight, although we would never allow it. Uh, let's take a look if something is about to happen. 30, Latin 40. It should go down a lot, lot more. So I'm starting to kind of waiting for the next tick here. And. Actually, nothing is going on. Okay, that's... Very disappointing, actually. Since it took me quite a long-ass time to um, sell that Lefanum. Is that... Just for one planet? No, it should be per planet, right? Did I miss one of those... Um, keys I needed to hit? I don't think so. Let's see... No, that's just an admin up. I don't think it will allow me to do that. You know what? Nobody cares. Uh, I'm not going to be bothered by it. I'm not, going, not even going to look at it. Ships upgraded. But, yeah. It, <sighs> I don't want to do that off camera again. It's very annoying. We're upgrading instead of filling in the blanks. Simply because... I don't have to look at... Bases... And I can just do it in one go. I am going to try this one more time. We're going to try this one more time. These guys will never be friendly towards me. Let's vote yes. And we'll start sending in fleets as soon as... Ah, uh... oh, damn you. Who voted against me? Why? Children, Who likes you? Their faces wet. 
I wish that it actually would show you like this, the acceptance. It. I don't think it would be too difficult to do. Ah, oh, man. Can we change their ways in a different way? Now, they're pathetic, so they will never go to war with us. How about these guys? I admit some of my people are impulsive. Oh yeah, we are actually supporting your independence. We are ready. And you have a coalition association. Okay, so we need to get rid of that newly formed guy over here that we actually got. And once he's out, he um, he should be able to do the rest. Let's just build this outpost because he's not doing it. Ooh. That's actually not a smart idea. That's a lot of influence. And it's due to Empire Sprawl. They just want to make sure you don't grow any bigger. Is there a way that we can actually go at... Why are you 27? Oh, it's probably the uh, the captain. Fleet is at full strength. And this should be at full strength. When do we get our new ships? Because I'm building quite, quite a bit of them. Let's see, what else is new? I like, let's go with um, leader experience gain. And let's go, the new um, torpedoes. Ship building speed. Hell yeah, let's take it. How long? 29 months. Not too bad. A war between the Bream? Independent? Yeah, the game is uh, currently stuck. So, give us a second. And um, once it memorized, it, it's actually doing something. Bite me. That was just making a fool of me. <laughs> you bastard. Can we go to war with them then? Look, they're inferior. Would we be doing a war with you? Who is actually voting? Let's see. Oh, one, two, three, four. Everybody goes in. Yeah, it's war. <laughs> the, this, this cannot fail. This cannot fail. Bolian League. Vote no, I don't care. Vote it. Vote you. Where there is no justice, there can be no peace. I know, right? I've been telling that for so, so long. Let's start at sending him. Come on. The war is done. The, with the Bream Confederacy. One. Two. And definitely four. Going in from there. Actually then go over there. The third fleet. Yeah, we're sending in everything that we have, guys. Why not? It's war. Finally. Um, energy will go down. Which is okay. Uh, we'll see what they have. I don't think they'll have as much. We'll um, we'll do the transports later again, like usual. Once we actually get some of these things going. Actually, the first fleet is already going in. They're like really, really fast. Nice. The Bream War, guys. Uh, one of the, uh, the last empires that uh, just don't like us. The rest is either vassalized or really close. Actually, are you one of their vassals? Would you be at war as well now? Ah, the nature politics. At war with the United Federation. And we're also at war with the... Wait a minute, what's going on? We, we got ourselves we a ready. big war. Are you supported by the Bring? Yeah, it's a defensive pack. We can get everyone at the same time. Can you imagine that? We're fighting with everything here. Well, let's we'll start off and just work our way down. <laughs> I think actually um, my own guys can deal with this. Oh man, that's funny. So let's take a look. You. We might just send you over to the Cardassians. And you, I would like you to go over there. So we'll have a fleet in here, a fleet in the Kardashians that should be enough for them. We can change their ways. 
And we can change the ways in every one over here. I think at least that's how it should go or would go. Let's make sure that where is that new fleet coming into? Okay, um, fleet management, six ships. Let's queue everything up. Two ships remaining. It's almost nothing. It's due to dilithium. So let's buy some. There you go. Fleet management. Reinforce. And one fleet could still get a ship. Well, that's not true. Oh, well, it's fine. Oh, we have a hostile fleet encountered of a whopping 6 and 5k. Yeah. Yeah, you just go there. You just go there, man. Actually, no, go here. You. Here. And then go here. There. And there. I don't care about these. We'll take them back. Oh, this is going to be fun war. I'm very excited about this. I'm sure you can tell. Um, and, and while we are at war, we are still building up the 5th fleet. And we will need to make sure we get the 6th fleet going as well. And we have a lot of work to do here. As you can see, soon we can actually build them up. New elections as, as, uh, are going in. Hostile fleet encountered. More hostile fleets. Yeah, that's fine. Uh, we can already start boosting, but I think it would be not the best of decisions to deal with that. Kardashians are sending in about 6k. And they're just sending in armies. So, is my one fleet is almost there. Yeah, we'll just deal with the Kardashians really fast. I think that's uh, the easiest one, since it's it's kind of it it's a compact area. All of them are still upgrading while building in Starbase Two. It's a relative safe position. I don't see anything happening soon. Look, there is no fleet that could deal with one of my shipyards or one of my biggest biggest stations. Hostile fleet encountered. Fleet oh, look at them go. They're sending in transports to Bajoran. Oh, you shouldn't have. You should not have. It's Hostile still 3k. In terms of, like, roleplay, this, this would be very, very cool. Still building the Galaxy class at 49%. 48, sorry, for those of you who are actually uh, looking at it. So, he's busy, busy over here. And let's wait until that's done. He's going over here, I believe. New territory. Mm, nobody cares about that. There is a lot of fleets detected. That's so nice. Look at them go. Oh, wow. Look at that. Oh, they got some firepower over there. That's five. It's, it's about 30k. It's nice. 7k over here. While we just start just tearing down there. Their fleets will go towards us. Okay, give me the, um, the countdown. Okay, where are you? I think it's this fleet. Yeah, you are going there. I would like you to go like that. We'll just deal with it like this. Uh, the Badlands, definitely go to the Badlands. And let's do it like that. And I wonder how my allies are going to handle all of this. Because that, this, is, this is massive. There's going to be a lot of, uh, probably a lot of lag issues by this. But this is precisely what we need. Once the galaxy is... Um, oh, mandate fulfilled, nice. Once the galaxy is friendly... And we can actually start integrating them. It will lose a lot of ships. It will. It will just keep those tiny sh ships at their main main station. Man, this is an all-out war. Perhaps instead of sending you over there, we should start sending you in here first. 
So I'll do it like that. Uh, the Sonic Command, who was actually fleeing from engagement, is now forced to uh, take actions as well. Uh, if these guys had joined as well, that would have been absolutely hilarious. I would have really enjoyed that. So let's take a look. So the Brain took tension, which is okay. So it's okay, nobody cares. Look at that. The Ferengi Alliance is sending uh, 12k into their territories, which is nice. And they actually have claims upon this. Do you see that? They have claims. Cool. So a lot of things going on here. And I don't dare to click them all away because of the noise it will generate. So ships are going to be done this year. So we can actually name it the 5th fleet. And we can start working towards the 6th uh, the fleet for Starbase 23. Which is close to the front lines, but not too close. Station is under attack. Sure it is. Yeah, it's it's around here. It's, it's okay. And he's actually moving back now. While we slowly, slowly start tearing away. That's not a hostile fleet. They should stop saying that transports are a hostile fleet. If they could just deal with anything that has firepower, then I'm okay with it. So, all of the engagements so far, we've won. Hostile fleet encountered. Technology discovered. Hey, new technology, here we go. We got the uh, new phases. Cannon firing rate. This is just a, a nice boost. Let's take it. Coalition Association offer. I will accept that. I will accept any of you. Wait, did I not vote on you? Okay, nobody cares about you. Yeah, it's almost all gone now. Fleet there is the hostile fleet at 10k going in towards the Federal. Actually, look at this. So, that's 12 and another 5. The Sherlock's and the uh, Ferengi, who were usually us uh, usually fighting each other, are now just helping each other. It's funny. That's fun. If this war goes wrong, it's it's a problem. Yeah, we're going to take down the Kardashian Union fleet. And uh, relieve the Trill. We could also just send my fleets to uh, counter their fleets. And that will increase their war exhaust quite a bit. Although, if they cannot build ships, that's even better. So we're just taking over the stations. Actually, we should deal with some of these fleets. And just taking all of this back. Eventually, they will try fighting my stations, like Starbase 2. And we all know that's going to fail. Prima is now from the Kardashians. We'll just continue the way we are doing it uh, right now. And just occupy Brame. Um, continue the mission. Construction complete. So if you go there. Then there. Then there. Then there. Eventually, you will force back all of those fleets. Uh, leader experience gain. Fleet leader lifespan. Hostile yeah, we need that. I don't want to lose all of my uh, my coolly named leaders. I really like them, all of them. And there we go. The trill, the and the bream, are fighting. Um, doesn't look too good for the um, for the trill. Although, will he be supported? There's one fleet actually trying to go for it. Hey, go for it, man. Hey, I applaud you. A first fleet not doing anything. Why is that? Because you're just sitting there not doing anything. You know what? Yeah, the station is about to fall. Let's just do it like this. Hunt down those guys. 
we could use the 5th fleet to hunt down other fleets. Ah, there's an engagement. I think. Can we please, please click the system? No? Well, there you go. Go. Uh, high intensity. Wow, this system is... Um, is something else, right? Yes. Oh, wow. Mad Deco. He, he lost a lot of firepower there. Hmm. Do we need to relieve him? It's because we are mainly a defensive empire, I guess. Yeah, this could be bad for that fleet. Uh, we're losing... Uh, yeah, that's that's definitely... We are very, very high on, on shields. Fighting in these systems... Not good. We need to get out of here. 19 days. And this could be... Definitely, we're going to be taking a lot of losses here. Fleet encountered. Uh, we're going to be uh, FTLing out ASA bloody P. I should have noticed that. But it, it, I was just so surprised about this fleet just being so bloody dark that I didn't see this one. Shield nullification, three days. Fleet Let's uh, FTL out. And we'll start uh, dealing with the other fleets like these. Are we still trying to hunt them down? We're not moving. Go there. Hostile fleet encountered. Where is me other fleet? There you go. Crack down. Uh, shut it down. Updated. Nineteen versus five. Yeah, that's some bad luck for the Bream here. How will we call this episode? I think the Bream Wars. Yeah. Because it's going to be some time until we get out of this war. It is what it is. Economy wise, we're doing fine. We are going to be getting a new fleet shortly. And he's going to hunt down all of these uh, annoying fleets. These transports are going to be killed. And my second fleet is about to enter the war with Y Gamer. You are on your way. I am still going to be sending them towards the Badlands. And the Zindi is now here as well. So it is... Yeah, they should win. They should win. That's another of their fleets going down. Yeah, in terms of this, it's, it's definitely tied. I like this one. I really like this war. I'm going to enjoy this. Anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching. I hope you're enjoying your time here as well. Uh, Latinum has changed, finally. 29 instead of 40. So we got a good amount of, uh, of energy. And what we're going to be doing, instead of letting the colonies fend for themselves, we are going to be buying a lot of uh, new population. And uh, I will go over these planets off camera so you don't have to be dealing with that. And I'll see you next time, guys. Have a good one. Bye-bye.